and you've seen this guy on our program a couple of different times. Remember a while back when he came in? You remember this, Sean? Oh, yeah. Sean Pallick, <laughs> he came in and drew that while we were on the air, Molly. It's not something Isn't I saw. Cool? I think I might have seen good. him doing that. I don't think I saw him do that, uh, that one. You did another one, though. Right? Did um, you draw something on I, here? I've painted a lot of things. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're supposed to remember every single thing you've painted. But Sean Pallick is here, and uh, he has a studio set up over in the East Village. You have not been there. Tell everybody where your studio is, because if nothing else, you can walk into his place, seriously, and you can start looking around, and you'll get lost in there. Yeah, yeah. We, we have a lot of artwork for sale. Uh, we're located at 506 East 6th Street, Suite 200. And uh, now put that in perspective to give people an idea where, where that is. Okay, okay. Uh, we're in between Streetcar 209 and Alba. Okay, so right in the middle of the block in between Des Moines Street and Grand Avenue. Got it. At, right next to the bicycle collective. All right, people know where that is. Yep, too. you know so, where the bicycle so collective is. If you're down is. in that in, in that area of the city, just walk on over. Now, what are your hours? Just to let people know about that. Uh, our hours are Tuesday through Saturday, um, generally. 2.30 until uh, 6 o'clock on Tuesdays and Thursdays because we both have class those days and then other days 11 o'clock to 6 o'clock in the evening. Now to everybody you have class, explain what that is. Uh, I, I teach out of DMAC and uh, so I have illustration class and airbrush class this semester and then my wife's taking an uh, intro to desktop publishing class um, and that you know kind of branches out into the, the different services that we offer there at the shop. Uh, Misty does uh, marketing and branding so if you have any uh, website development or branding that you need done she can take care of that for you uh, i offer custom painting so i can literally paint anything on anything yeah for example if you go to the surface again there eric uh, you can see what he did here uh, see those helmets the one Ooh. on the right is a real barnstormer helmet we got from the barnstormers the one on the left is the one i race with the one on the left is painted the goggles are painted the one on the right is a sticker that tells you anything. This guy is very talented. What's the most Thank common you. form of custom painting you do for people? Um, mostly now I just do canvases. Um, I do a lot of pop culture stuff. I do uh, family portraits, portraits of your animals. Um, and then this is something else that we offer here is we do uh, paint parties. We have a uh, coloring, or excuse me, we have a watercolor paint party and then we also offer acrylic paint parties. I didn't know that. Uh, yeah, and then I also put on art shows. Um, so there's there's always something going on. Uh, something that we launched recently was our uh, coloring book meditation class. Now, what is that? Um, it's it, it allows you to come in for about two and a half hours, and uh, it's like yoga for the mind. So you sit down and you go through a guided meditation program uh, with an instructor, and they have you design a mandala, which is a geometric. Uh, concentric geometric pattern and then you color it in and she discusses what colors evoke what feelings within you and you really focus on uh, just trying to find some serenity with coloring it's it's great fun everyone needs stress relief and that's something that we offer uh, it, it takes about two two and a half hours and uh, it's just a really stress now when do you offer this um, we, we have different uh, times we have day classes and evening classes uh, everything can be found on palacstudio.com. Uh, on our website, we have a calendar on there. It shows all the different events we have coming up. And this coloring for adults is huge now. I just read this article, I think USA Today or something. Yes. They can't keep adult coloring books in stock on Amazon.com. This yep. is some. This is a big thing. So really? I imagine in big cities they're doing this. So it's cool to hear you talking about something that's going on in big cities happening right here in Des Moines. Yep. Now, it's something that we're, we're trying amateur, to get started here in Des Moines. Yeah. As an amateur who's kind of thinks something like this meditative coloring would be fun. Mm -hmm. Do you have to have any art background no, or no like, art background at all? I don't all. have. I don't think much talent. It, but I think it would be something fun to try. Well, everyone knows how to color. And, True. You know, everyone yeah. learned it you know, in, in preschool and kindergarten and grade school. It's just getting back to that point where you didn't have stress in your life and you're thinking about going out and playing at recess and you I know, just, <laughs> just, just ways to, to de-stress and to get your mind into a peaceful center. And just to take a break from everything else and like you said to kind of reconnect with your inner child. Exactly. But yet, those art pieces look 
don't look childlike. They look like something. Yeah, and, and it's great fun, and an you, you'll have your own piece of refrigerator art to put there it. I love it. With I'll your put it magnet. over my kid's yep. stuff. Forget that thing you made. <laughs> yep, you, yep you're, you're gone. I'm putting mom's stuff up here now. <laughs> All right, what else do we have available at your place? Uh, well, I have my annual Halloween horror show coming up. Uh, that'll take place uh, towards the end of October. Um, it's my seventh annual Halloween horror show. I, everything Halloween related, usually have between 20 and 40 different Des Moines artists participate in it. Uh, it's great fun. Uh, we have a Goonies movie night where we're going to just sit down and watch Goonies in the <laughs> in the shop. Speaking so. of childhood. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Right. Exactly. Um, we, we like to keep things fun. We like to keep things fresh. Uh, we have a great venue. Like I said, if anyone needs uh, a venue for rental for a music event or for a uh, adult birthday party, um, we, we try not to have too many kids events because we do have a lot of artwork in our gallery uh, or even a meeting space for your business um, what better way to have a meeting than to be surrounded by beautiful artwork mm -hmm. something to talk about too yep Definitely. exactly all right and you've been there how long uh, we've been in the spot for nine months now and uh, we're I mean things just keep getting better and better People walk by constantly now and they're starting to recognize the spot, starting to recognize the artwork that we have in the windows. And uh, we have the South, South Des Moines Art Fest coming up here in a couple weeks that we're gonna be down at. Uh, and uh, that Tony Barber and uh, her husband Phil Barber right. put on. And it's just a great time. We'll be out there, we'll be at the uh, Des Moines Authors Fest coming up. Missy's gonna be at the Des Moines Women's Expo. So we have just tons and tons of stuff coming up. This really is a neat spot. If you have not been over to visit Sean and his gallery, tell everybody one more time where you guys are located because there's some really cool stuff in there. Uh, we're located at 506 East 6th Street, Suite 200, uh, Des Moines, Iowa. And uh, we're just right off the interstate, get off on the East, East 6th Penn Avenue exit, and we're about three blocks off of there. Uh, right next to the Bicycle Collective. There you go. And also, stop in the Bicycle Collective. They do great things there. Mm -hmm. Definitely.